Okay, so I'm gonna start by priming my eyelids with a Maybelline concealer. So I'm gonna be using my new palette. I was so excited to purchase this is because I've heard a lot of good things about this little palette. Um, I travel a lot, so I'm really happy that I got this in my hands because I can have this in my bag, I can take this with me anywhere. And since I broke my Too Faced mirror <laughs> that I would always carry with me everywhere, um, look at that. Um, I purchased this and I was like, oh, it has a little mirror. Like when I opened it, I didn't notice that it had a little mirror ready with it. So I'm like really, really excited about this. Anyways, we're going to be trying this out and see what's up. I'm going to be starting with this color right here. That's going to be our transition color. Um, it's really pretty color. And it's really pigmented as well. The only thing I'm like not liking is the palette. It like, I don't know if you can see, but it kind of has a lot of fallout. Like, I don't know, I don't really like that, you know? It's gonna get messy quick just because it's black and yeah. Alrighty, so next I'm gonna be using with the same brush, which is a Morphe M433. I'm gonna be using this one right here. And I'm putting this one lower lower um in the other color i'm going to blend um the two colors together really good Okay, so once the two colors are blended out pretty neatly, now I'm going to be adding the, the brown one. And I'm going to be focus, focusing this more on the outer of my eye and then um, going into my crease but very lightly. I just want like the, the outer corners to be dark. going to be adding the little gold color that's in the palette so to apply the glitter um, eyeshadow on this palette and I'm going to be using my cut crease brush from Morphe as well it's the Morphe M508 and we're gonna add a little bit of this blitz just so it could be a little more um, intense you know a girl loves to glow just tap, tap, do some tapping motions on here what I love about this brush is that, well, it's perfect for cut creases and it's like, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's like, um, circled. So it's like perfect. You can go around like the edges and stuff. So you won't go over it. It's perfect. Wow, this is really stunning. I am shock. I really love this. Okay, so I'm gonna grab a more detailed brush and I'm gonna be applying more of that brown, that dark brown, on the places where I applied it, obviously. So, blend everything together once more. Once again. And then so the, so my um, eyeshadow can be more snatched. I'm going to like clean it up a bit. Some concealer and my flat brush. One dot and two. Just a little dot so it won't be too messy.
Okay, so next I'm gonna be applying my Gerard Cosmetics Slay All Day Spray. And I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Fit Me. And this is the matte one. And of course, blending it with my sponge. Concealer to highlight my face. and blending. and powder and I don't like baking so I'm just gonna like set it like and then once I have put it I'm just gonna take it off right away okay so now I'm dusting it off I hate this pimple, so I'm gonna cover it up. So next, I am gonna pull in my bronzer. Nothing new, same toothpaste bronzer. What's broken mirror, you know. Blush and the same blush, of course. The Mac. I'm mixing the two together just because I like how they look together. I don't know. I'm weird, but yeah. So now, applying some Fix Plus. So now I'm going to do my lower lash line and the first we're going to be going with the first color, our transition color. And then I'm going to be using that, our second color that I used. And lastly, I'm going to be applying the brown, but I want it like upper so I'm gonna use a like detail brush this type of brush and the brown so I'm gonna be blending all those colors together So it looks like I'm gonna get my so I'm gonna go ahead and fix this shit on her way and work on it, you know. Okay, so, so next I'm gonna be applying some mascara to my lower lashes first. And then I'm gonna apply my lashes, my little lashes in Miami, nothing new. Same old, same old Brie. Hey bitches, I'm back. Okay, so now I'm gonna apply some mascara. Okay, so now. Okay, 
So now we're gonna be applying some highlight, but first I was like to spray my face, just a little highlight can be more intense, you know. Like I said, your girl like love to shine. Your girl loves to sparkle. And I'm gonna be using my e.l.f. highlighter. Buñuelo. And so my husband calls me, he calls me Buñuelo. Just kidding, he doesn't. I'm gonna tell him to call me that though. Okay, so next I am gonna apply my lipstick. And I was honestly so excited about this part just because I got this. Yes. Oh, I was so excited. I really needed a red lipstick just because I used to use the Okay, just because I used to use the ColourPop one in Crepe, I think it's called. And honestly, like, I really loved it and everything for a while. But then after a while, I think it, like, seven C or something. Because I, I started putting it on, like, not too long ago, like a month ago. And, like, it would just, like, have a lot of balls and it was nasty. So I was like, oh, this shit. So I threw it away. I was like, I need to get my hands on a new red lipstick because I love red lipstick. Like, you can never go wrong with a red lip. And... I was like, mm, I need to find one. And then I found out that Rihanna came out with a red lipstick. And I honestly didn't know. I just thought she had like the lip gloss. So I was like, I need to get my hands on the red lipstick. The reviews were awesome about this lipstick. So I was like, I have to get it. Guess what? Your girl got it. Okay, so I honestly already tried it, guys. Like, ugh, I loved it, honestly. It was, it's the best red lipstick ever. Like, not just because it's Rihanna, but. It is honestly, hands down, the best. It's so freaking gorgeous. Okay, so let me model for y'all. Ready? Let's take that. Okay, so yeah. That's the end of this video. I hope you guys really liked it. Enjoyed this little makeup tutorial. Um, I honestly really loved the palette. Such beautiful colors. I recommend you getting it if you like warm tones and if you go for that. Um, also, if you broke your mirror and you need one, this is really cute. Also, the lipstick. It's really, really bomb. I highly, highly recommend the red lipstick. You can never go wrong with a red lip. Like... You need this in your life, girl. Let me know if you guys are going to get this lipstick and if you guys love it like me. Also, the palette. I highly recommend both of these things. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Comment what you guys want to see next. Give this video a thumbs up. Turn that little bell on just so you can get notified every time I post. Even though I post once a month. Just kidding. I'm going to try to post. Like, I'm going to have to... I'm... Ugh. I'm gonna try to like come up with days that I post, you know, so you guys can know. Anyways, yeah, thank you guys for watching.